So Simona, what were the operations that you served in as a young person? Um, I've done theater, and lion hunting, and Operation Eagle. And show us the gun that you used when you were fighting. What a remarkable sight. Zoom in on that gun. Remarkable. What did you use this gun for? Well, so I used it for well, um, my boss used it for killing tigers. Mm -hmm. Used it for killing people. And I also used it for pretty much trying to kill the lion. Right. And how many people? Did you kill? I killed, well, I think I killed 1,001. 1,001 or 1,000 people. What a remarkable story. So how did Operation D-Day start? Well, I was pinned down and I was trying to reach my, um, not Operation, trying to save my friend. Right. It was too late, but those Nazis never knew to quit. I ran to the trench as hard as I can, but Corporal Gabriel um, saved my life. I owed Gabriel my life that day. We were pinned down, but Gabriel ran out of ammo, so we had to run behind the rubbish bin. The gunfire stopped and Gabriel loaded, so we prepared to attack. And that was our interview with the last survivor of D-Day. Um, just taking. And Gabe. And a lot. That. Um, not. The gun sees the never to quit. No, never knew it. Nazis. I forgot. Okay. <laughs>